What we want to talk about is, and again, is the, is the role of genetics, and that's why we're here today to, to really learn and to showcase the farmers. So we've two Angus cattle behind me. We bought them both, all from the one farm, so same farm. Um, if you look at the two of them, they actually cost the same money. They cost 260 euros each. But when we look at their, their CBV, okay, um, the one nearest me here, uh, 3365, has a CBV of 29 euro whereas the, the animal 3441 has a CBV of 136 euro, okay? So a massive difference in their CBV value, okay? So, and that's their genetics, okay? So what that shows is that this animal near me is going to make, on average, will be over 100 euros less profitable, okay? That's in its genetics and that's what it tells us. The better performing animal is currently 45 kilos heavier, okay? When you kind of look at his conformation, in my opinion, he's going to grade more, have a better kill out. And we're estimating there's going to be over 120 euro difference in carcass value. So for a farmer, you know, that has a huge impact on the profitability if you're buying 20 calves or 50 calves. So it's so, so important to get the genetics right. And that's what we want to get out of today. And it doesn't matter if it's an Angus or a Hereford, uh, the CBV is something we should be looking at. And you will be seeing that more in the marts going forward with the, you know, the likes of the National Genotyping Programme that you'll have more animals with CBV value. So it's really important buying cows to buy cows with good, with good genetics.